Well guys, this is a quick video log of story, you know, I just wanted to share, I guess, to maybe it'll save somebody else's life someday, who knows, but this is a short story of um, yesterday I about lost my life right here on the, uh, this river right behind me, I won't say the name, but I've had some run-ins with this river over the years, kayak and uh, deer hunt, and Yesterday was definitely the closest I've come to losing my life there. I'm pulling this sled here full of minerals out to a new property. It's about 200 pounds. Yesterday is about 30 degrees colder than it is right now, yesterday morning. And I don't know what I was thinking. I stepped out here. It didn't look like that yesterday. It looked more icy. Actually, it was pretty warm yesterday in the afternoon, but <sighs> obviously we all know don't step on ice in the river. You don't know how deep it is. Um, but this river is not known particularly for being deep anywhere. And so I, uh, I wasn't even thinking, honestly. I thought I'd be stepping out on a sandbar, get it to that easy snow and finish sliding it up where I'm going. First step in, broke through the ice more than six feet deep. I just happened to throw my arms out, catch myself. My arms caught the lip of the ice and my toes couldn't touch. Was already, my legs were already sweeping downstream here. And, but my arms held and I was able to push that sled back up off me, back up the bank here and get myself out of the water and just beeline half mile back to the truck, stripped down and get warmed up quick. It was in the single digits yesterday and uh, just, it was dumb. Um, the reason I want to record this though, isn't to talk about don't step on the ice in the river. That's something we all should know. And it's something that I know. I wanted to talk about the effects of hypothermia. Um, I was wearing basically what I'm wearing today. Um, so I didn't want to sweat so much walking. And we started pretty early yesterday morning, just me and the short hairs here. Walked about three miles on a public piece, um, pulling some cell cameras to bring to this new property. And then bolted over here in a hurry and dragging that sled. So again, I wasn't wearing too many layers to be sweating going in, but I'd been outside for probably three hours or so in single digit with wind chill, even lower. And obviously I just wasn't thinking clearly. And it just goes to show, you know, like the effects of hypothermia. That's what I wanted to hit on and make sure everybody's focused on that paying attention, people know where you're at, especially if you're doing deer work out here in the winter time. Um, just be safe, guys. I mean, that's as close as I've come to losing my life for sure. And if you look down the river here, if I went under, I don't know where I would have came back up or if, and it's just scary. You know, it really hit me after I got home and I was chilled to the bone all day yesterday. and. Uh, just recognized, you know, I was just, I was underdressed for being out in the cold um, for that long time and almost lost my life because of it. But be safe, guys. We'll see ya.